Whitestown are looking for the man who may be connected to an attempted abduction. They say it happened Wednesday. They say a man approached a 10 year old boy who was riding his bike and told him to get in the van. News 8's Brittany Lewis is here with more on what police are saying about this. Pretty scary. Yeah, a scary situation for that boy, his friends, and mm -hmm. then of course all the people who live in that neighborhood where it happened. Whitestown police say the 10 year old boy was riding his bike in the Clark Meadows neighborhood when two men in a white van pulled up behind him. And then police say the man driving told the boy he had something to show him in the van and to get in. At that point, um, the boy did exactly what he was supposed to, did an excellent job of bringing attention to himself, screamed, called for his friends, and he was on his bike, so he pedaled away down the street towards uh, people. The van just kind of freaked out, took off, and left the area. That van, though, was captured on a neighbor's surveillance camera. It has green decals on the side of the van, three windows on the driver's side, and four windows on the passenger side. Police say the man driving was white in his mid-30s with brown hair and a brown mustache. The passenger could only be described as a man. Police say they were either, either find out who is in the van or they will make sure they are so present that it won't happen again. Parents in the neighborhood say they will also be on alert. Whenever I see people out, most parents are with them, but sometimes I do see kids alone. So now, you know, definitely way more protective, of especially other kids in the neighborhood too, not just my son. Whitestown police are asking anyone who lives in the neighborhood to look at surveillance cameras in their home, especially between 7 and 8 p.m. on Wednesday night when this happened. Please say if you know who might be driving that white van or if you see that white van to call the Boone County Dispatch Center. Ladies. All right, Brittany Lewis, thank you so much.